Hello everyone, welcome to the M5 Stack Basic tutorial video. Today, we will introduce how the Flash firmware for the Atom 3R Cam using M5 Burner and demonstrate how to develop programs using the Uflow to graphical programming tool. Before starting the experiment, please prepare a Type-C USB cable and ensure that the M5 Burner desktop application is installed on your computer. Next, we will proceed with firmware flashing using M5 Burner. Log in to your M5 Stack Community account. Select Atoms 3 from the device list on the left. Download the Atoms 3 RCAM firmware. Connect the device to your computer using the Type-C USB cable. Press and hold the reset button until the internal green LED lights up, then release it. The device will now enter download mode. Select the firmware version you wish to flash and click Burn to start the process. Bind the device to your account. Configure the necessary settings for flashing, such as Wi-Fi credentials. Click Next to begin flashing. If you need to modify the configuration later, reconnect the device to your computer in download mode and click Configure to reflash the settings. Next, we will proceed with Uflow to programming. Visit the Uflow to website, log in to your M5 Stack community account. Uflow to supports to development methods, online programming, and offline programming. First, I will demonstrate online development by Wi-Fi. Click the device management button at the bottom to view online devices and select the currently connected items for your time. Next, I will demonstrate controlling an M5 stack unit product unit RGB using the items for your time to make the RGB light blink. Click Run to execute the program. Now, I will demonstrate offline development via USB. Modify the program as needed. Click the web terminal button at the bottom left. Select the serial port connected to the Atom 3R cam and click Run. If you want to flash the program directly onto the device and save it, click the Flash button. Next, I will demonstrate an official demo. This demo implements a real-time video streaming server with integrated QR code recognition 